An example of the liquidity ratio is the net working capital ratio. The net working capital formula is current assets minus current liabilities. We can get both of the current assets and current liabilities from the balance sheet. So let's calculate the net working capital ratio for the year 2018. Current assets is equal to $40 million minus current liabilities of $15 million which is equal to $25 million. The unit of net working capital ratio is dollars. So this means that the total current assets exceed to total current liabilities by $25 million. Consequently, the company can cover its short-term liabilities. It is healthy for the ratio to be positive as negative net working capital indicates short-term liquidity problems. It should not be too high, however, as it is better to invest in assets that generate a higher return, such as long-term assets, while short-term assets generate a lower return.